Hello and welcome back to the Royal Legion SMP. It's been a while since I've recorded on here, but we are back on to another video. In the last episode, I helped Spice Mines with his Wither Skeleton farm. It was fun. It was pretty cool. Um, we're still working on getting it to work. I'm not sure if it's working or not right now, but from what I know, it doesn't function as it's intended to but it does function a little bit so that is good now in this episode we are going to head upstairs <laughs> we're going to head upstairs actually wait hold up let's go back and uh, yeah in a couple of episodes back I said Spice Mines had left me something and well this is it brown mushrooms and I'm happy because I need those but I also need spider eye, so I can make, well, fermented spider eye. Now, the thing is, you see, oh, what? Let's, let's, let's sleep. Let's bed in here in the community house. Sleep real quick, get the rain away and stuff. And boom, done. So if we go over here. Okay, that was creepy. If we go over here, follow this road. I think that needs to be taken down because it's way out of season. But um, we have my potion ingredients shop here, right? Well, this plot over here was taken by King Cameron Games because he wanted to make a potion shop, a shop actually, because apparently he came, he got the idea first. But he has told me that if I give him a lot of gray, I think light gray concrete, then I will be able to take take that shop over. Plus, I also have two other shops here, and I think this might very well be this one. This shop right here might very well be done in the hmm, in episode. What episode is this? I don't remember. But not in the next one, but in the next next one, because I know what I will be doing in the next one. I think. So I'm gonna be looking forward to that. Now I also cleared this area. But I'm not sure if gonna, I'm gonna make that yet. But basically, if I give Cameron King Cameron Games enough like gray concrete, then I will be able to take over and make potions. So basically, make a potion shop. Um, and I don't know if I will then be closing this. Oh boy, I need more guests here. <laughs> I don't know if I will be needing more potions. Sorry. I don't know if I will be making a potion ingredients shop and a potions shop, then I would probably rather do the potions shop because, yeah, I think that would be more fun. But anyways, and then turn that into something else, which I think I might have an idea of, but we'll take a, we'll, I'll think more about that. Let's go back home. We've spent enough time thinking and doing stuff. Let's get up here and I'll show you what we're going to be doing today. So, if you remember, in a couple of episodes back, we made this tree plantation, which looks amazing, I hope. Um, yes, we are still going to be doing something with that area down there. Soon enough, soon enough, I have so many plans. But, in this episode, we're gonna fence in this entire area, or at least this half, or this part of the, of the mountain. I think I'll start with this one and leave this one free for now. But actually, no, we will be fetching in this entire area. And that means also removing all of this dirt. Well, most of it anyway. Get back. I don't have that much armor. I do not want to get in direct contact. There we go. String. I want spyri. I might leave some of this stuff. Some of this hill. But... And the pond over there. Because it's beautiful. But for, now, for right now, I need this area fenced in. And I want everything to be level to begin with, and then I can do my own terraforming from there. So what I'm gonna need, as you can see, my armor is pretty bad. I need to make some new. And, well, I have some mending books from Spice Mines, actually, from helping him with the Wither Skeleton Farm. And also for another project that we're going to be doing, but they're right here. I have six in total. I'm saving one for a... Elytra, and then five for my sword, or bow, probably sword, and my armor. So, excited about that. Um, okay, so I think, what am I gonna need? I have my efficiency pickaxe, 
will I need any potions for this? I don't think I will. I think I'll be good without... Um, I will be needing a lot of fence. Like a crazy amount of fence. So like, this is not even gonna be enough. So I'm gonna need to chop down a lot of trees to get the f amount of fence that I need. So, also do I have any sticks left over? No, I do not. All right, well, let's get to it then, I guess. Mm, let's clear, mm, actually I need some, do I have dirt? Yes, I do have dirt. Okay, but that's, that's not enough dirt. <laughs> oh boy. Um, oh, 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 let me, let me show you, um, let me show you what we got for the Andes expedition, if you haven't seen it yet. So we got some chopper shells, we got the end rods, and I picked up some cherished flowers and some cherished fruits as well, and the magenta banner, which I think I know what I'm going to be using for, but I'm not sure yet. Um, we're going to make a, make, a, make a thing with this, some of this stuff in the future, but I think I'm actually going to make a shulker box real quick to keep my inventory free. So what you need to make a shulker box is pretty much just a chest. And two shulker shells. Bada beam, bada bam. Do that, and then do that, and boom, shulker box. So, what am I gonna need? I'm gonna need that stuff, and I'm gonna need some more dirt. Like that, probably that much. Actually, no, just that. Actually, give me that. <laughs> because I've got to be removing that entire hill, so that's gonna be a lot of dirt. So, let's pick that up. Cool that it says what's inside it. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I always forget stuff, so let's hope that doesn't happen. Let's put that there. I need some food. Yeah, I need to need to find out how I can get some more food, which is one of the reasons why I want to fetch that area in. I don't think I ever said why I wanted to fetch that area in. That's because I'm gonna make the bay way up upstairs there at the top of the mountain to the farming area. I already have the tree plantation. So now I might as well make it into the animal area as well, so fence it in. The sheep will be here, the pigs and the cow. Um, I don't know if there are two cows here. And I can expand with adding plots of different um, vegetables and stuff like that here and there. But first, we need to clear this entire, entire area out. It's going to be a tough one, and it's going to be a time lapse. So, starting time lapse in 3, 2, 1. I accidentally broke my best diamond shovel. Oh boy. Um, okay. Where is there a enchantment table I can use? Um, oh boy. You know what? Let me empty my inventory and I'll be back. <laughs> I'll probably be back once the project is not done, but the entire thing is cleared out. So, see you then. All right, we are back at the construction site. A creeper and a spider again. Huh. Well, there you go. <laughs> Take that. All right, so I got my new diamond shovel, brand new. I'm bringing three efficiency four. Perfect for what I need to do. I'm just gonna clear this out. Um, that's a lot of stone that needs to be cleared as well, but. I did think of using TNT, but I mean, that's, I want to save that, I guess, for other stuff if I need it. But um, yeah, let me just do this and I'll be right back when I'm done.
I think you've had enough time lapse. You know what? Let me know if you enjoy the time lapses down in the comments below, or if they, or if they should just cut out whatever I'm doing. Let me know down in the comments. Anyways, I'll see you in a second. Just one problem. My pickaxe is about to break as well. I might need to go down and repair it, but I'll do that when it has no more color on the bar. Oh boy. The repair episode, I guess. Or the tool, or... Uh, no, that's not good. Anyways, I'll continue. You know what? Fire in the hole. That went pretty well, except that this wasn't supposed to happen, but it's Minecraft and Minecraft physics, and it did get pushed a little bit, but huh. it works. Pretty well. <laughs> Makes it a little bit easier. All right, the entire place have been, well, cut off. So, now what I want to do is probably make this into t multiple parts, but I want to basically run a fence along the edge like this, wherever the mountain is. I'm not going to terraform the, the edge of the mountain, I'm just going to do it right at the edge here and follow the mountain all the way around, pretty much, so like that, and then basically keep all the animals that are in in but that's gonna take a lot of fence and a lot of wood and yeah I better get cutting all right I got a bunch of wood I didn't get all of it and I didn't replant all of it yet but I'm gonna do that at another time right now I just want to get all of this done now let's see if I can remember how on earth to make a fence I probably can't but we'll have to see I believe it is like this. Yes, all right, good. So like that and like that should, I hate when it does that. Give me that. Okay, it's not gonna be enough, but it's gonna be something. So place that and, or maybe it will be enough. You know what, let's hope. Let's hope it will. I doubt it, but let's hope. Let me just place all this and I'll be back. And boom, finally, that took a lot of wood and also a long time. <laughs> but right now, this entire place is fenced in. All I gotta do is just to make two quick fence gates for this area over here, which I cut off right at the end of the wood or the path here because I wanted to do that. All right, cool will make this look good at a later time. I think this is gonna be part one because this is kind of getting long. So part one complete, we cleared it out. We placed the fence also. There is a reason for these two holes. It leads down into a cave that leads to my tongue actually. So I might want to make something cool with that. Um, but for right now, this is it. Part one complete. We cleared this place out. We put fence around it. Now we just need to replace that stone, maybe add a few hills a few layers of dirt here and there, maybe add a pond and maybe add some um, plots with some uh, vegetables in it and farmland and put this into an area as well. Maybe get some more farm animals up here and make this pretty and remove that thing. And also like something like that we can get up here, for example around that. So that would be pretty cool if we can do that. But anyways, this is part one. The sun is coming up. And uh, yeah, I think we're good for now. So I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment, and share with your friends. And if you're new to the channel, remember to subscribe. And if you got any suggestions to this or to any other thing, be sure to leave them down below. But anyways, hope you enjoyed and hope to see you next time. Have a nice day. Also, remember to join my Discord server. Link down below. But anyways, hope you enjoyed. Have a nice day. Bye.